Blastoise. What is going on, fellow Packbusters? It is episode three of our Icoria opening. So um, we're shifting dates up a little bit, as you probably saw last week. We're actually going to do magic on Wednesdays, and we're going to start doing uh, Christy and I's big old mystery basket live openings on Tuesdays now because Addison goes extra late at dance <laughs> on uh, Wednesdays up to 9 o'clock. And so we want to try and keep those uh, times pretty fluid at 8.30. So we're going to shift magic to Wednesdays. And we're going to continue to open magic because it's fun. And just trying to do something a little bit different. So by the time this comes out, I think this, is, this video will be up the Wednesday before... It's a new set gets really Zendikar Rising. And so um, I wanted to get through this box and get it open, and then you'll probably start seeing some Zendikar openings. Uh, there might be some on days other than uh, Wednesday, maybe a Saturday video or so. We're going to have uh, Tim Weaver here. Uh, he bought a couple of cases, and we're going to open some of them up for y'all uh, just to show you what the set is all about. 10, 11, 12. So we're going to open half the box in this video. We'll open half the box next week. And we're going to see what we can get. So we didn't do half bad in the last box. I will keep the box topper for the next video. And I'm going to do my best to try and keep these to under 15 minutes again. So I know the first two were not because I really didn't know what I was looking at. But uh, after, now that we've gotten through a full box... I'm just going to get through these, and the artwork is, I, I mean, you can't really beat it. Uh, we did do fairly well in the last box. I don't think it was as good as it could have been, but um, I did get the box topper that I wanted, so that was uh, pretty cool. But, uh, ooh, here we go, Everquill Phoenix. All right, that's a new one. I haven't seen that one yet. That one's pretty sweet. And then we got Swiftwater cliffs and a human soldier so um, i'm really liking the art i haven't got back into playing yet uh, just kind of taking my time because pokemon takes up most of it um and then this video will be out the wins i should be getting champion's path today so you might see a double upload in terms of doing a live uh tonight as well but um, we will see what happens. Ooh, the Ozolith as the rare. And then we've got Pacifism. The butterflies all hollowed out there. So that one's pretty cool. Uh, we've got a regular Plains Land. We are going to sleeve this hollow up. But um, yeah, uh, lots of stuff coming. Uh, Going to continue to do sports cards on Thursday. Uh, I'm really enjoying those. Uh, the quality of sports cards these days are great. But on to the magic. I think we about broke even uh, money-wise on the last box, but it's not about the monetary value. It is about the fun that this stuff brings and the art. So Mythos of Snapdax. All right, there we go. Is the rare... And then Windscarred Crag and no table required. Magic the Arena. Little, what do you call that? A promo or promotional uh, thing to tell you that you don't have to play with physical cards. But I think it's way better to play with physical cards as much as, you know, being able to play online is great, especially during these COVID times. But I really think that the... Ooh, Slither Wisp, Dinosaur Beast as the token in a regular Forces land. I just like the interaction with people um, playing in person, so I'm looking forward to Pokemon, uh, finding some more spots to play, it being a little bit more readily available. Um, but, uh, you know, everybody knows this COVID stuff has it all messed up. So we'll play online from time to time. Unexpected Fangs, that one's pretty cool. A little dog-looking thing trying to eat a dinosaur. These things would be awful to see if you were just walking through the forest. <clears throat> Facet Reader. There we go. Pouncing Shore Shark. I don't think I've seen this one yet either. That one's pretty cool. Uh, put that off the side. We've got a Parcel Beast. Boon of the Wish Giver. Right, that one's pretty cool. 
And then the Triome. So I was told that these Triome lands are where it is at by Scipio. So we're going to put that up top of that. And it is a rare. Good stuff. Forest, Island, Mountain. We've got a prickly marmoset, spontaneous flight. I wish I could just take flight sometimes. Startling development. Looks like some Jabba the Hut looking thing with the bald eagle. Bushmaster. We've got a wilt. Some crazy looking heron bird thing. Looks like some crazy looking bug. The kids would just freak out. The fox eagle thing. <laughs> and... We've got Splendor Mare, ooh, and Zagath Triome, little full art things. That's back-to-back -back Triomes. And then we've got the Wingfold Terran in Thornwood Falls. So we got our second hollow, and we got two of the Triome lands, so that's pretty cool. I don't remember getting any the last time around. We are, um, we did end up getting the Sharknado, but I like the card a lot. I'd like to see that in the, um, the hollow format. But we've got the Phase Dolphin. Some crazy fire dinosaur thing. Survivor's Bond is like nothing else. Aegis Turtle. More of the fangy, crazy looking things. Facet Reader. Alert Head Bonder. Insatiable Hemophage. That's just ridiculous. Stormwind. Ooh, here we go. Riel the Evervise Mythic. So that's our first mythic of the video. A regular forest and a human. Soldier, token, which just seems to be the bulk of them. We did get one of the sharks last time around. That was cool, because that was the one that I actually wanted. Um, what do we got this time? Ooh, we've got the companion. All right. So keep safe. Everybody keep safe out there. It is still insane out, but um, you all know what you got to do to take care of yourselves. Voke Pete, migratory great horn. All right. Another heron, Dreamtail heron. Here we go. Call of the Death Dweller. Some tiger, deer craziness looking thing. Kateria crystal, Lurus of the Dream Den, and a regular forest energy. All right. It is a cat nightmare. If Bailey's on this cat kit. I don't think she needs any kind of cat nightmares going on. <laughs> Daddy, I want a cat. I want a kitty. I want a kitty. We got her a kitty for her birthday, like a stuffed one. And I found it in the refrigerator yesterday. So that was interesting. Evolving Wilds. Memory Leak. Essence Scatter. Greater Sandworm. Pacifism. Doesn't look as good that way as it does. Savai Thundermane is pretty cool looking. Ivy Elemental. And a Dirge Bat again as the rare... And we got a dinosaur! We got a dinosaur! Alright, we got those things. Go for blood. Alright, spontaneous flight again. The commons are very, very common. This one's actually really cool, dude. Sit there. Dead weight. Gotta get rid of that dead weight. Volpakeet. Alright. Moss coat. All right. Weaponize the monsters. That's how you win a battle, I guess. Cunning Night Bonder and Dranith Magistrate as the rare. And look at the. I mean, the lands are just awesome looking. Not like those basic ones back in those revived days when I played. <coughs> oh, here we go. Human soldier, and then we got a scoured barons as the land. We got Blade Banish. Pretty cool looking cards there. Capture Sphere. Sudden Spinnerets, Mutual Destruction, Thwart the Enemy. You cannot win unless you thwart them. Keen Sage Mentor, Easy Prey. I wish deer were like that most of the time during deer season, but they're not. We got an Indath... Wow, we got all the Triums in this video. And then Insatiable Hemophage. That is a bad ass looking hollow right there. Check that out. All right, cool. So we got our second hollow. That one's really cool looking though. Um, it seems like we're getting all of the, a bunch of the Trion lands this time around, which we did not get. Um, I cannot remember those from the last time. We got a Tiger Gorilla thing, Cavern Whisperer, Humble Naturalist, Facet Reader, Sleeper Dart, 
memory leak, another sandworm Ooh, that would hurt, alert head bonder, we've got blitz of the thunder raptor, another crystal, and a crystalline guillotine. That's a pretty sweet looking card. A giant artifact, and then a blood fell cave. So let me know what you think of these MTG openings. Um, I'm enjoying it um, simply for the art. And maybe when I get back into playing, um, it'll have a little bit different feel to it, just in terms of cards that I'm looking for to play. You've got the Super Jellyfish. Um, so let me know what you think of the MTG openings. Um, either way, if you like them, if you don't like them, uh, if you, uh, if you like, like them for the art, I know most of the people on the first video had commented that they had no idea what it was, but they liked the art and they kind of liked the change of pace, and so we'll just keep the change of pace, maybe uh, we'll switch it up from time to time. Um, and then let's see what the, we got the Thornwood Falls as the land. Uh, maybe we'll try, let's try out some other cards, I know some people asked for Yu-Gi-Oh! Um, I know nothing of the sort, and so I might tell you guys other people that do it um but the artwork on those cards is pretty cool and we got snap decks apex of the hunt all right that one's pretty cool legendary creature dinosaur cat nightmare all right some more nightmare cats that's kind of crazy all right so we'll move the as Scipio would call it, the jank stack off to the side. Oh, there we go. I want to get this in the hollow, but the shark is amazing looking. All right, I like that one. Glimmer Bell, Garrison Cat, Keep, Safe, Coil Bug, Blazing Volley, The Marshal, a Sabertooth Tiger, Ooh, a Liger. Sanctuary Smatcher, Parcel Beast, and then the rare is Unpredictable Cyclone. All right, that one's pretty cool looking. I'd like to see that in the hollow. We have three packs remaining for this video, and we will see if we can get anything else. Oh, there we go. Another Prickly Marmoset, the Porcupine Monkey thing. I, I, don't, I don't know. Job of the Hut. Dark Bargain. I'm pretty sure that Adam's going to have something to say about my Star Wars references. Looks like a Sarlacc pit there. there. Speaking, Speaking of, of fight as, as one, flame spill, and, and we got an extinction event. event. All right, two, two packs remaining in, in this half of the box. box. Remember, on the second half, half of the boxes, boxes we will open the box topper at the end. end. So, so if that's, that's what you're looking for, I mean, look at that. It's like crystals growing out of the swamp. Can't beat the look of these lands. They are pretty sweet. Frost Lynx, Tentative, Perimeter Sergeant, Ram Through, Boot Nipper, Anticipate, Blazing Volley, Unbreakable Bond, Grim Dancer, and Sky Cat Sovereign. All right, so on to our final pack of the video. Oh, I think this might be the last Ikoria box we open, at least for a little bit. Um... With uh, Zendikar, Zendikar Rising, Rising coming out, I think that's going to be the movement, movement going forward to keep things new and relevant. relevant. Whip's Leech, Ooh, Cloud Piercer. These like cards, cards that the art is all over the, the, the card itself. itself. Pretty flipping sweet. Barrier Breach, Blitz of the Thunder Raptor. Ooh, we got, got Jangatha and a Rugged Highlands. All right, so, so we, we did get one Mythic in this video. video. Um, and, that and that was the snap decks, decks. So, so that was really cool. cool. Um, Apex, Apex of the hunt, hunt. And, and then, then um, we, we did get, get a couple of, of we got three hollows as well. well. I think this is the better looking of them in terms of just pure look. look. But, but thank, thank you very, very much for watching episode three of Magic the Gathering here on the Pack Busters channel. And, and um, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, again, again, let, let us know, know what you think of the MTG openings, uh, what, what you, you would want to see if we have the opportunity to do so, within, within reason. And, um, yeah, yeah, this, this uh, should, should be coming out on, on um, probably, probably seeing a lot more Champions Path on the Pokemon, Pokemon side. side. So, so until, until next time, everybody, happy pack busting, stay safe, see you next time. time.